Good morning, gang. We are here at Disney Springs bright and early, which is why we have our sunglasses on because it's very bright and very early. But we are so excited to be here at Springs for a very, very special event. Come along. It's based off our name. And Travis was just saying that we have never been to Disney Springs this early before. It's always like a nightcap, end of the night sort of like trip to have dinner. Yeah. But the reason why we are here this early is because there are a lot of places at Disney Springs that serve brunch, Sunday brunch to be specific. So our friend Nate, Paging Mr. Morrow, was invited by Boathouse to bring some friends along to try out their new brunch. It is called the Captain's Sing-Along Brunch. Um, so I have my captain's hat on today so we are really excited to check it out it is the very first day that it's opening so we're gonna get an exclusive look for us and for you guys I'm excited to, to brunch away babe I'm hungry I'm <laughs> ready I'm yeah. ready to eat all the things all the things for brunch to begin I'm craving a little bit of goodies the Gideon's Bakehouse has just opened at Disney Springs and you can already see how popular it is. A line has already started. Good thing for us, they do have a virtual queue that they'll just send straight to your phone when you sign up for it. Right now it's about two and a half hour wait. So I think that's gonna be a perfect amount of time for us to go have brunch and then, you know, have cookies after brunch, you know? That, that's what you do. And on Boathouse's Instagram, it said, beginning Sunday, February 21st, join us for Captain's Sing Along Brunch. We have dueling pianos and a brand new brunch menu. And wear your captain's hat or boathouse shirt and get a free mimosa. Now that's kind of why I wore my little homage captain's hat. I don't think we're gonna need it today to get free mimosas since we're kind of coming in for a preview. I think we're gonna get those anyways. But when you guys come, try to wear a little captain's hat or a boathouse shirt and you get free mimosas. Can't beat that deal. Yeah, you cannot beat that. I'm following him all the way. Captain Nate. Oh my goodness. And we're getting the boat. Thank you. I said our captain is here. Ahoy matey. Ahoy matey. And we're already in the boat. We're in a boat. We're At the boathouse. Boat it's total inception. Thanks for brunch. inviting us, Nate. Yeah. And like I said, you guys, I have been here multiple times. Travis has never been. And every time I come here, I'm like, I want to sit in the boat. What, what, what do I what do I gotta do to sit in the boat? I guess you have to come to Boathouse Brunch and you get in the boat. But we're so excited to try out the tasting menu. I mean, this is the first day, so there's a lot of pressure, but I'm so excited to try it out. Here is the little brunch menu. They have all the drinks your heart could desire and all the brunches. Oh my goodness, looks really good. And we're starting off with some Boathouse bread. Everything begins with a B. Oh, I like <laughs> I'm gonna get the pear mosa, and I've never had a pear flavored mimosa before. It's a Koppelberg pear cider with white peach puree. And Travis and Nate are checking out the Orange Crush. It's a Stoli orange with Solarano orange juice and soda. And the pianos have started. We're so excited. And speaking of starting, here is the start of our brunch. This is the avocado toast topped with a delicious egg, a gigantic Belgian waffle with a little side of bacon, and Nate was just in awe of these chicken and biscuits. I mean, they're never-ending chicken and biscuits. Look at that. That's amazing. With eggs on top. All right, let's try the Belgian waffle. Tastes waffly. And this caramosa is giving me all the happy vibes. It is so unique. I think so far, that's what I'm loving about this brunch is everything is very different. Like I've had bellinis, I've had orange mimosas, I've never had a pear mimosa. And then the chicken and biscuits, they had like a Creole to onion. Die. Yeah, to die for, but it was a Creole onion gravy. I've had multiple gravies in my life, if you can't tell. Um, and they're all really good, but this is so unique. It's very oniony, but not overpowering. So, so far, the uniqueness of this brunch is what's really getting me going. I think every, everything we've tried so far, obviously, the uh, biscuits and gravy have been the best so far, but yeah. there's still a few more things. And we're not even close to being done. There's still steak coming. My, oh, there's my yolk. That's the shock. 
right there. You gotta be yoking me. Oh, you're yoking. <laughs> and here is the little paper you can fill out to request a song for the dueling pianos. You give them a little tip, put your little song you want, and they'll try to play it for you. And Miss Jackie has got here. She's my girl. Best part about this brunch is they keep bringing out the food. So she got a whole another plate of biscuits and gravy to herself. So good. They're playing Nate's song. And I'll be okay. <laughs> And Jackie just got here and she's already trying to show us up. <laughs> Look at this Bloody Mary. Holy. I can't stand up there though. That's bloody big right there. Tray number two. This is the shrimp and grits. It's spicy cheddar beer cheese grits, shrimp, and dewy sausage with some eggs. This is the jumbo lump crab cake benedict. Twin crab cakes, prosciutto ham, poached eggs, and holiday sauce with grilled asparagus on the side. And then this may look simple, but this is the lakeside breakfast. It's two eggs, any style, choice of bacon, smoked sausage, home fries, and ciabatta toast. This eggs benedict with this delicious prosciutto on it. Um, it's definitely the pursuit of happiness. Hey, they're playing your song. Hey, Beach Boys. Maybe we're by the water. Why not some Beach Boys? One more drink before our final entrees come. And this is the Strawberry Splash. It's Koppelberg Strawberry Lime Cider with white peach puree. And our final entrees are here. This is the Steak and Eggs. New York Strip Steak with home fries and eggs. And then this thing looks so classy. It's a smoked salmon bagel. Avocado, cream cheese, arugula, red onions, tomatoes, fried capers on a fresh bagel. I'm not gonna lie, you guys. I've never had salmon for brunch. Only dinner grilled. I don't even know if I've had cold salmon, let alone on a bagel. Oh my God. But let's try it out. That is super amazing. Look at that. Tastes salmon y. And after every meal, it's so nice to finish with a little coffee or tea. So, we're gonna try their specialty martini. It's an espresso martini with Stoli Vanilla Kahlua Liquor 43 with espresso. Camera's out. Martini's up. Cheers. Oh, oh, oh. There are small ships and there are big ships, but the best ships of all. Our friendships! <laughs> I didn't know where you were going with that, but then I did. And I was like, and then you're like, oh. And our virtual text from the Gideon's Bakehouse has come in that our time is ready. So I would say that virtual queue worked out pretty good. We finished brunch and it was delicious, but now I don't know where I'm gonna fit all those bakehouse goods. I'm gonna have to find some room. We gotta go in Gideon's too. Oh my goodness, Tony. Tony, what have you done? They are bringing us the classic boathouse rubber ducky drink. I have been told it's called a duck duck raz, and it looks pretty razzmatazz. Let's give it a try. I'm keeping the duck too. I'm keeping it. So good.
really good. <laughs> I was hoping you would say something with a B. <laughs> Brunchalicious. It was brunchalicious. I don't know if we have more room, but we are gonna try to shove some Gideons in because we haven't tried this yet, babe. Travis's sister wants us to bring him some cookies. Yeah. We wanna bring some cookies home for family, so we're gonna go in. I've heard they've had like a super cool, like steampunk kind of goth vibe, which is right up our alley. And then there's dessert, so you really can't go wrong. You guys, it's our time. It's our time. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Welcome in, guys. Just saw the markings on the ground. Thank you. <gasps> it is Tim Burton, Nate. Right? It's Tim Burton, and I smell really cookies. I'm so excited. Can you already smell it? Yes. Oh, wow. <gasps> Look how stinking cool it is in here, guys. Sorry, I'm nerding out right now. She called us to come order and look at this, you guys. Can I go like this? Oh my goodness, that's so cool. We want everything, one of everything, please. Yeah, sure. <laughs> we have all of our Gideon's goodies. I love that, I love saying Gideon's goodies. It just sounds so exciting. And then this is the peanut butter coffee. I love coffee, I love peanut butter, and then this is even like a green uh, biodegradable straw, which you guys know I love the paper straws. So let's give the straw and the Gideon's coffee a try. This is so good, better than any coffee I've ever had at Disney Springs. <laughs> we were talking how big the boxes are, but that's because I bought cookies, coffee, and candles. They have a candle in there that smells like cookies and coffee. So I had to buy it. Jackie already said she bought it for her house. So. I've been trying not to burn it because I don't want to use it up, but now I have another. Well, now we have one too. <laughs> cookies, coffee, and candles. It's the best thing. Oh my goodness, look at our cookies, you guys. I don't want to I don't want to open up all of them because we we bought some to share with family. But look at this cookie. <laughs> Is it a cookie? Is it a brownie? Is it a cake? Wow. Yep, this is why you buy a bunch of them because they are for sharing. Well, we are stuffed between brunch and the bakehouse and all of our bros on the boat. Bros on, the beach. on a boat. With it was brunch. a beautiful brunch. Thank you, Nate, for having us. The boathouse, you guys hit it out of the ballpark. You hit it out of the boat. Where's Jackie? There's my boat, babe. Thank you guys for coming along. As always, peace, love, and positivity, and all the good things. Bye.